Happy Tuesday. Hey everybody. Say hey once you pop on. Thanks for joining me here on our Peek into Pink. Say hey and make sure you tag your beauty consultant so she knows you're on here. Hi friends. Oh hey Chelsea. I know you. Hey. Hi Sarah. Thank you guys for being on. Hey Octavia. Okay, I'm gonna give us just a couple more seconds for people to pop on. Hey Pam. Hi Sadie. You guys, so when you pop on, if you'll do me a favor, because um, I think this is so cool that this is obviously an event that's touching a lot of people all across the country. So if you'll just say, hey, um, tag your beauty consultant and maybe tell, tell me where you're from. I always love to see you know, what parts of the country. Um, pop on. Hey Susanna. Oh, y'all, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, all right, we already have 117 people on. Whoo, y'all, this is exciting. Oh, okay, awesome. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and get started. Um, first of all, my name is Kelly Brock. <laughs> I live in Charlotte, North Carolina. I am a senior Cadillac sales director with Mary Kay. I'm a mama of two. I've got a three-year-old. Um, little girl named Everly. I've got a 10 month old little boy named Rainer. Um, I have a handsome husband named Josh and I've been working my Mary Kay business for eight years and I have the privilege tonight to pop on our little peek into pink and just tell you a little bit about my story um, and tell you why I'm one of many, many, many women who have found that Mary Kay is an opportunity, a vehicle to their dreams, an opportunity that is allowing them to be successful and so you might just be popping on here to help your beauty consultant, um, maybe help her advance in her business or help her with a challenge, or maybe you're popping on here because you really do want to peek into our pink world and find out if this can be something for you. So first of all, thank you for your time. I know it's your most precious commodity um, to give us a few moments of your time, and I promise I will just take minutes of your evening um, tonight. So first of all, we are going to be doing a little housekeeping. We're going to do a free product drawing. So when I get done, do not cut off this video early. I promise I'm worth it. Um, the stories are worth it. Um, but at the end, I'm going to tell you how to enter yourself in the free product drawing. So make sure you comment, tag your beauty consultant, ask me questions. Um, I'll hop back on here and answer them or try to answer them as I go. But again, I just so appreciate it. So um, a little bit about me. I just told you I've been working my Mary Kay business for eight years. This is actually the second time I have been a beauty consultant with Mary Kay. I started the first time. I don't even know what year it was. I bought a starter kit and was like, oh my gosh, this sounds great. And then I didn't realize you like actually have to work <laughs> and put yourself out there. And I, I held one party one time. This girl asked me if she would look good in a purple eyeshadow. And I was like, uh, I don't know. And I let fear take over me. And I was like, I'm not qualified to do this. And I quit. I legit emailed my sales director and I was like, hey, you can take me off the email list. Like I'm not doing this thing. So flash forward three years later, I found myself in graduate school. I was getting my degree in public health. Um, I was a uh, health and fitness girl, corporate wellness. Um, but I found myself working a full-time job, going to school to get my degree, and I found myself engaged. I'm one of four kids, and my parents said, oh my gosh, congratulations. We're so happy you're marrying the love of your life. Um, we've not been saving for your wedding, so you're going to have to help contribute to that. And I was like, what? <laughs> I have to do what? And so I thought, how am I going to make extra money when I don't have extra time? And I had stayed in touch on Facebook with my friend, Jordan, who I had joined um, with the first time. And guess what? When I quit, you guys, she didn't quit. She kept going. And I saw her social media and I saw she was at Starbucks in the middle of the day. And I saw that she was driving a pink Cadillac and she was always spending time with girls. And like, it seemed like she was always at a party or like having a lot of fun. And I just thought, okay, what if I tried this? Like, what if I just gave this a try? Because she kept going even when I didn't. And so I reached out to her and I was like, look, I don't know if I can do this. I have a million reasons, you know, why I would be terrible at this. Like a million. Like, you guys, I used Jergens body lotion from my feet to my face. I had no skincare routine. <laughs> when I showered, if I showered, <laughs> hygiene has been something that's come from my Mary Kay business, but I would literally teach a group exercise class and go to my real grad school class and then go back and 
work out again. Or, you know, like I, I just wasn't someone you'd be like, I, you know what you're doing on your face? I'd love for you to come over on Saturday night and teach me and my friends. Like I was so unqualified. You know, I just thought this wasn't for me for like a million reasons. I'd never run a business before. I wasn't confident, um, you know, standing in front of people talking and helping them feel more confident about themselves. And you guys, I had no sales experience, period. Um, I was like, you remember in high school when you get those um, boxes of candy bars that you have to raise money for your school? I made my parents buy those king size candy bars every single year, the entire box, because I wouldn't even go up to my next door neighbor to ask them because I was petrified. I was just a recovering people pleaser. I never wanted anyone to see me coming and feel like they had any kind of pressure on them. And so the list of all the reasons, you know, why I thought I would be not good at Mary Kay, all the reasons I shouldn't, I couldn't, I wouldn't do Mary Kay was really long, but I had a couple reasons why I thought I should. And those reasons were pretty valuable that they were enough to make me say, what if I tried again? What if I just introduced a cleanser and a moisturizer because that's something I can do in my normal routine and introduce it to, you know, a couple of my friends and just see where it goes. And you guys, Thank God our products are so amazing because I literally got around kitchen tables or got together with girlfriends and I just was like, okay, so here's how you wash your face and here's how you care for it. And I just tried the products on their skin, but thank God our products are so amazing that even when I did a bad job, I was like, okay, thanks for coming. And I was like ready to get out the door and they're like, oh, well, can't we buy something? Like, can we take this home? And I'm like, oh yeah, of course. Yeah. Mm. Let me call my director and figure out how like I make a sale because I just didn't know what I was doing. I... I was kind of like Miley Cyrus on a wrecking ball. Like I was make, I was like knocking things down as I was figuring it out. But my friends loved the products and their skin was changing and my skin was changing and they were just so impressed. You guys, if you didn't know this, Mary Kay, we're leaders in the industry of skincare and makeup. And so I, I could represent a product that was going to impress my friends too. And so guess what kept happening? I kept having more fun. I kept introducing it to more friends and you know, my confidence grew. And so then I started fitting it more and I started getting around other kitchen tables and I started fitting it in nooks and crannies of my life, you know, on lunch breaks and nights and weekends where before I was just seeing what happened. And I started falling in love with my Mary Kay business. I always say it's kind of like falling in love with the right guy. You date the wrong guy and you're like, mm, you know, if we see each other, it's not a big deal. But when you find the right guy, you're like, I'm staying up till midnight talking to him. I can't wait to see him tomorrow. I'm going to find all these opportunities to fit him in my life. And that's how Mary Kay became for me. I just started falling in love with it. And you guys, in my first six months with Mary Kay, I earned my first free car. And then four months later, I earned my second free car. And then 30 days later, I earned my third free car all while still having all those things on my plate. I was still in school, I was still working a full-time job. I was still engaged or at that point a newlywed. No, I was I was still engaged. So I was like fitting this in the nooks and crannies of my life and making it successful because I started being intentional. And it was so funny, if you guys don't know anything about the career car program in Mary Kay, what they do is they say, oh my gosh, you and your team are doing fantastic. We want you to drive a free car for us totally for free for two years, 85% of your car insurance paid for it, okay? Like I haven't paid a car payment, you guys, since February of 2011, that's a very long time ago. That's like seven and a half years ago, and um, or seven years ago. And anyway, or if I didn't want the car for free, they would give me a cash compensation. And so my first car, I could have taken $375 a month. And then the second car, I could have taken $500 a month. And then I found myself in my first year with Mary Kay earning my first pink Cadillac, um, which if I didn't want to drive my pink Cadillac, I could take $900 a month. I'm a mom, you guys. Do you know how many like minivan leases I could get? I could like have the minivan of my dream with like the flip down <laughs> TVs and like all the things. It's like incredible and it's so funny. So um, my friends were all like, Kelly, you don't even wear lipstick and like you've earned your fourth free car. And I was like, I know, like I can't believe it. Like I was just as shocked as them, but I just kept showing up and just kept trying. And it's funny. I. I live my life in moments. I think about photos. If you follow me on Instagram, you know my, my pictures are pretty. I love to take pictures of things that I love. And so I remember my life in photographs. So I'm gonna show you some pictures. So here's a picture of me. 
That is, and I can't really see it well, but there I am picking up. This was my third free car with Mary Kay. It was a black Mustang. I named her Dallas. I literally went to Dallas, Texas and picked up this car. The company ships them to you, but I was so excited because I earned this one. It was the first one. And um, I, so I flew to Dallas, Texas and drove it home. And it was just, again, my friends were all like, Kelly, I can't believe you're doing this. And I was like, y'all, I know. But it's working because the products were so, you know, incredible. And so I kept falling more in love with my business. And it was right around the year that I said, okay, I'm making more, if not even money with Mary Kay. What if I like actually gave this my time and attention and really wanted to go full time? And so at, um, you know, at my full year with Mary Kay, I went full time with Mary Kay, started my career making it my my big girl job, and I earned my fourth free car, my first pink Cadillac. And so this is a picture of me. This was actually my third pink Cadillac, but this is a picture of me and my daughter Everly two years ago picking up our fourth pink Cadillac. No, third pink Cadillac. Um, that's a fun thing to lose track of how many free cars you guys have gotten. But this was her, this is my daughter. She's three years old. She's never spent a day of her life not being in a pink Cadillac and it's just been so crazy. I'm actually, you guys, waiting at any moment for the dealership nearby to call me and tell me to come pick up my fourth pink Cadillac, my seventh pink, you know, free car with Mary Kay, which has just been incredible to have moments and memories like this. You guys can't imagine how much money we've saved by not having a car payment since 2011. And so I've got, you guys, I've gotten to do this in a lot of stages of life. I've done this, um, you know, in lots of different ways. I did this when I was um, an engaged and I told you I think in memory, so I love to share just some precious moments that have happened because of my Mary Kay business. So this is a picture of me. You see me right there? And I am on a bed because one of the first things that my Mary Kay business afforded me was an entire bedroom suit for my soon-to-be husband and I. Um, I got a bed and two nightstands and two dressers and a mirror and all these things, and I literally sat down thousands of dollars in cash at this place. And again, I was still working a full-time job. I had all those things still on my plate, but I just decided to keep working my Mary Kay business. And I was, this broke a belief barrier for me because I was able to say, if I can do this for my family, if I can do this for myself because I decided to accumulate little efforts of Mary Kay business, what could I do if I really tried? And so this was a big barrier belief um, being broken for me. And so another thing was this. This is a picture of my husband and I. Isn't he handsome? That's my, my man, Josh Brock. This was us on our honeymoon. You guys, I paid for our honeymoon. This was the second thing that I was able to be like, oh my gosh, what could I do for my family through this vehicle, Mary Kay? I paid for our honeymoon. My parents didn't, his parents didn't, he didn't. I paid for our entire honeymoon through the the profits of my Mary Kay business. And you guys, I, I was like, we were on the cruise and I was like, have as many margaritas as you want. Like have as many French fries as you want. Take as many excursions as you want because I was so proud of myself for creating an experience for my husband because of my work that I'd put into my Mary Kay business. And so it was just such an experience that I was proud of. And this is a picture, um, the thing I'm most proud of right now, my Mary Kay business. This is my family. That's my husband, Josh, my daughter, Everly. That was Rainer when he was just, um, I think maybe a month old. He's 10 months old now. I need to get an updated picture, but this is the thing that I am most proud of is that I have had an opportunity to grow in my Mary Kay business and now I'm able to be a work from home executive income, six figure income with Mary Kay because I decided to start and not stop. Another really cool thing that my business has afforded me, where is it, is this picture. So when I started y'all, my ambitions were to sell some cleanser and moisturizer. Didn't think past that. So the fact that something like this happened to me, this is a picture of me, there's me, I know you can't see it very well. Do you see this banner? This is New York City Times Square. I was on a billboard for a Mary Kay I Can campaign where they took real women in, in the, work, you know, in the um, workforce of Mary Kay and they had us share our stories on why we have been successful, what our Mary Kay businesses have afforded us. And I said, I can become the woman I've always dreamed of being because of my Mary Kay business. Well, they took my picture and they put me on the billboard on New York City Times Square. So my best friend Jordan was on there too. We flew to New York City with our moms 
And it was incredible. So I'm in the, I'm in the cab with the, the taxi driver and I'm like, he's like, Oh, so what are you guys doing here? You know, in, in New York vacation fun. And I, I was like, Oh, well actually we're, you know, on a billboard in Times Square. And I was like, so are we like the most famous people you've ever met? And he was like, well, no, probably Julia Roberts. And I was like, oh, yeah, yeah, she's definitely way more famous than me. But I was like so thrilled because I didn't imagine experiences like getting to tell my daughter that at one point in her mama's life, she was on a billboard in front of millions of people in the busiest city in the world, which is New York City. I mean, it is just such an incredible life memory that I was afforded because I decided to see, to try, to see what this, you know, could do for me. You guys, I started this to make a little bit of fun money. And then I started it to help furnish my home. And then I kept going to, you know, fund my honeymoon. And then I decided, what if I did this for a real job? And then I was able to make executive income. And you guys, I'm just an ordinary girl from Charlotte, North Carolina, who has a degree in public health. Like I had no prerequisites that said, you'd be incredible at mentoring other people and building a business and servicing customers and helping women feel confident. I, I didn't have any of that. But what I'm just hoping to impress upon you is that there is so much available to women when they say yes to a business in Mary Kay. And the heart of our company, you need to know, is absolutely extraordinary. Our company was created by a woman. Her name is Mary Kay Ash. She started this business opportunity 55 years ago. We just had our anniversary on September 13th, so just this last week. And she started with a dream to create something that would enrich women's lives. You guys, all these business, other business opportunities that are out there, gosh, I, I always cheer for another woman, you know, other women who are doing something else, but I'm just telling you, we're, we started this thing a really long time ago. And why I believe that our company is so standout is because of the heart and the core of what we are about. You guys, our company started this um, with the priorities of God first, family second, career third. And those priorities line up with who I am. It's one of the incredible things that our company is debt free. We are privately owned. Our, our business doesn't have to make decisions based on stock market crashes or you know um, executives who you know want to make a little bit of extra money. Our company has heart. Our company is aligned with priorities, and so we're able to service our, our customers fairly. We're able to think about our sales force. Um, you know, with the things that we're doing. You guys, our company is in 37 foreign markets. We are all across the world. We are not just good at what we do. We're, we're not just doing the thing, we're doing the dang thing. We are number five in skincare and makeup globally. Like, you can feel very, 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 very proud representing a brand that is not just doing it, but is doing it exceptionally well all across the country, all across the world. You guys, our products, if you've heard of the FDA, I'm sure you know what FDA is, Food Drug Administration. Well, they've got like this many standards of what you have to do to get a product on the market. There are products, on, I have cousins who live um, in Europe and they, they're like, Kelly, some of the ingredients you, America uses, we would call that poison here. And it's just true. People can take things from underneath their sink and mix them around and put them in a jar and put them on Etsy or put them on the web and anyone will buy them. Well, there is something called the European Union and they have 1,500 more um, standards for um, products to be out on the market. And all of our Mary Kay products are European Union tested, which means they are of the highest safety effectiveness um, product testing. Our, our company spends more money on product testing than anything else to make sure that when you're putting ingredients on your largest organ, um, that you're getting something that's safe for you, you know, safe and healthy and effective. And you guys, our, our products, we test them on women and let them break out. We are PETA supporters since um, the beginning, since the 70s. And so, you know, it's important for you to know we do not test on animals, we test on women and we find, you know, what we need to do to make that product absolutely um, impeccable. And if you didn't know this already, if you have been shopping Mary Kay products or if you haven't yet, you need to because when you shop Mary Kay products, you guys, from the company's 50% profit, they give back to the Mary Kay Ash Foundation, which supports two major women's issues, domestic violence shelter grants, um, and then also research for cancers affecting women. And you guys, one out of three women are affected by cancer or affected by um, domestic violence. That means it's either you or your sister or your mom. And you guys, just a couple months ago, our company gave us a challenge 
to sell a million new Miracle 3D sets. It's our brand new innovative anti-aging skincare line. And they said, when you guys sell a million, we'll donate a million dollars out of our corporate fund to the Mary Kay Ash Foundation on top of what you guys have raised throughout the year, throughout your sales. Well, we donated another million dollars. So we had almost six, I think over six million dollars donated to the Mary Kay Ash Foundation. And you guys, I am currently not a domestic violence um, survivor. I am currently not a cancer survivor, but I have a daughter and I have best friends and I have nieces and I have women that are going to be influenced because of women who chose to support their small business beauty consultant in Charlotte, North Carolina or wherever it is. The future for these women and my future, who knows, Lord willing, you know what it will be, are, is going to be influenced because women decided to shop Mary Kay. So I always just say, even if you're watching this tonight and you're like on the fence, if you even want to shop Mary Kay products, do it. Because it's not just affecting you. Um, it's not just influencing you know your small business that you're supporting. It's influencing the futures of all the women who you love near and dear in your life. And I just love to share that. And you guys, I think there are things that you should know about Mary Kay and the opportunity and why you should consider it for yourself truly because this isn't something that's just for me. It's for other women and it could be for you. It's $100 to start a Mary Kay business. Um, you guys, that's 10 little $10 bills. Um, in it, you get $400 worth, worth of full-size products that are the best-selling products. It's our new anti-aging skincare. It's our um, hand pampering system. It's um, our best-selling CC cream foundations. It's our best-selling mascara, eye makeup remover, all these full-size products. You get an entire boutique in a bag so that you can introduce products to your friends and family. You guys, we are a relationship-based business. We want you to get together with your friends and know them and love them and have them try their products because guess what? If you're like me and you're wrecking balling it all the way in and you're like, I don't know what I'm doing. You don't have to know what you do. You have to just show someone to wash their face and wash it off and put it back on and how does that feel and do you want to take it home tonight? And the products sell themselves because they feel so incredible. And so you get all of that in there for 10 little $10 bills. And you guys, you could be watching me right now and be on your way home, like listening to me in the car and stop by Target because you need toilet paper for your family. And you walk in and you go to the dollar section and that dollar section is really the three to $5 section. And then all of a sudden you see these beautiful pumpkins with little fake succulents in it. And all of a sudden you're like, I, I need to decorate for uh, Halloween. Absolutely, right now, on my way to get toilet paper. And then you see all the <laughs> clearance clothes that are now marked off. And then you remember you're hungry, so you get some almonds. And then you get your toilet paper and you go to checkout and you do what I did, which was spend $160 two day at Target. <laughs> and in two days from now, you guys, I'm not gonna remember that money I spent at Target, that all those things I just talked about, I just bought at Target today, <laughs> along with, little shoes for my walking baby. But the truth is you're not going to remember that money in, in two days from now, right? You're not gonna feel it anymore. But $100 in Mary Kay could change your life. It could change your, your circumstances. And with that, you guys, you get a mentor. You get someone like me who is what I call the best gift with purchase. You're, you get someone who, it's our job to help you be successful and to help coach and, um, you know, support you. And what I love, you guys, our, our company has been around 55 years. And what that tells me is there are, there's a business plan to run on. It's been working for 55 years. There's no way in the world that it can't work for you. There are too many women succeeding in Mary Kay right now in this very moment, your beauty consultant being one of them, that this can't work for you too. Am I right? And so what you should know is not only is that hundred dollars, which is y'all unheard of to start a, a personal business. It, it doesn't even, it costs thousands, thousands of dollars to create an idea, to create an idea, to go to someone, to say that you want to start your own business for a hundred dollars. Like there's just no excuse, right? And so what kind of money do we make in Mary Kay? Well, we make a 50% profit. So we make half of what we sell. So if you can divide by two, you know how much money you make. And we make money the minute we sell it. We don't have to wait two weeks. We don't have to wait for a Monday. We don't have to wait till the end of the month. We make money the, the moment we sell it, literally right here in front of me is my, I had a girlfriend come over. She wanted to talk about a product and she spent $131 with me. So I made half of that just for spending 40 minutes of my time because I had products on hand to service her quickly and I handed it to her. So we make 50% and you guys imagine 
if your child was sick and like my daughter, she had a ate a peanut cookie one day and we realized, oh my gosh, she has a peanut allergy and her whole mouth swelled up and we rushed her to the ER and now we have to have EpiPens on hand. And all of a sudden we had to spend hundreds of dollars on you know, medication for our dollar. Like what would you do if something happened in your life, you blew two tires or your child needed you know, money, what are you gonna do to make up the extra that's gonna pop up in your life? And that's what owning a business can do for you. It can give you freedom and flexibility to have those options to make that extra income. You guys, if you're gonna ever sell something, sell a product that runs out. Mary Kay products are consumable. They run out every three to four months. My customers, when they started with me eight years ago, you guys, they were just, they were young like I was and they were buying lip gloss and mascara. Well, guess what? They're all eight years older now and so they're looking for retinol and they're looking for anti-aging creams and they're looking for great foundation and contouring and it continues to grow with you as you grow in, into all the new seasons of life and so, it just makes sense. You know, I was just on maternity leave a couple months ago and I made money every single day for the work that I had done years and years ago. And so if you're gonna sell something, sell something that runs out for sure. The second way we make income is team building. And you guys, team building is such a privilege to invite another woman to have hope, to have her own options, to have her own flexibility plan. And so the company pays us from their 50% profit. We're not an MLM or not a, a multi-level marketing program where someone up top makes bukus of money and the people underneath have to like pray one day they get a chance to get to the top. In Mary Kay, we make money two ways. We're dual marketing, 50% profit from the day you start to 50 years into your business. And the second way we make money is by team building. It comes from the company's 50% profit, never from your team members. So you never have to feel pressure of saying, I wanna move up or I wanna be successful. I need you to be working your Mary Kay business. It allows women, Mary Kay created this business plan so women could come in and work for the things that they find value in, the things that are important to them, the things that are gonna benefit them. And you guys, it, it gives you flexibility. I always say that Mary Kay kind of fills a lot of buckets that women are looking for because women, you guys, we're busier than ever. We're expected to be Instagram moms, right? Like, so have a rockin' body and feed your kids only organic food and work a full-time job. And then don't forget to have self-care and don't forget to love your man. It's like, can I breathe? Like, I, I, I like can't do all these things. And so women need something that is going to fit into the busyness of their lives because guess what life does not I'm finding out from newborn to two-year-olds to three-year-olds to preschool to school like life is not slowing down for me and so I have to find a way that I can build a business in the middle of life happening and so we've got to still be able to have something that allows us to have the harmony the things still on our plate and so what I loved about my Mary Kay business was I was able to build this on girls night on bachelorette weekends online you guys i'm working my mary kay business right now talking to you and i put my two kids to bed and i came in here and i talked to you and i'm working my mary kay business and so then you could choose gosh do i want to be intentional and find out what this can do for me so there's a lot of ways you can do that one of the other great things you guys you get all the tools and resources you would ever need to be successful i always tell people there's one prerequisite to be successful in mary kay you have to be willing if if you aren't willing to try something new if you aren't willing to learn well then it, maybe it's not for you. Maybe owning your own business is not for you. But if you're willing to learn a new skill, everything I've ever learned, even the skills of speaking to you right now, I've learned in my Mary Kay business. The tools, the support, the mentorship, it all comes with it and it's incredible. One of the best buckets that it has filled for me has been the sweet sisterhood that comes from being a part of Mary Kay. You guys, I just believe that we were designed in creation, like by creation, by our creator. To desire community we want sisterhood you we want to be with other women who make us better and in mary Kay, you are a part of the most incredible sisterhood you get to spend time with some of the most standout women i've ever met in my life they are bigger thinkers bigger dreamers bigger believers harder workers um you know better servants better friends than i've ever met in my entire life and the truth is they have supported me in hard seasons. They have supported me in good seasons. And these are the kind of women that you want in your corner. You may not know you need new friends. And I'm not saying you can't keep your old friends. I'm just saying you want these friends. They make you better. And that's a part of the thing I would never trade in a million years is who I've become in the process. The personal growth that I have received, I would never trade because 
by default, by being in Mary Kay, by be, by being surrounded by these women, you by default are a better version of yourself. And there's something that happens with the stretch of entrepreneurship. It, it makes you step outside of your, yourself. I remember saying, I've got all these limitations. I'm not confident. I'm, you know, I don't know how to run a business, all these things. So I had to learn to stretch. But it was the stretch of entrepreneurship that also happened in this unique culture of Mary Kay where women were holding each other's hands saying, me too, I'm doing it too, we can do this together. Y'all, other businesses, they like cut each other's throats. They like don't look out for each other. And Mary Kay, we are, I say we're not even like friends. It's deeper than that, we're family. We're like extended family. And there's something that happens when you're a part of Mary Kay that you become more. You get more belief and you get more courage and you get you know more growth and your insecurities start to fade away and all of a sudden you find yourself being filled up. And what happens when you fill up? You get to fill up all the other people around you because you're the one who's pouring into them, right? As a result of being in Mary Kay, I'm a better sister, I'm a better friend, I'm a much better mother, I am a better wife, I'm a better communicator, I'm more giving to my community. I, I, I'm a better servant because of the skills and development that I have learned through my Mary Kay business. I was afraid, I was fearful, I was all of those things before Mary Kay and that has changed because I decided to start and not stop. If you're somebody who's looking for achievement, my gosh, you can win here. This is one of the many diamonds that I've earned. I've earned carrots and carrots of diamonds that I, I don't even know how to count them anymore as gifts through my Mary Kay business. I've earned free cars. You know, if you're looking for advancement, you guys, you can do anything you want in Mary Kay. The first time I started my Mary Kay business, I did nothing. I came in and I decided to do nothing. And the second time I came into my Mary Kay business, I started and I said, I want everything. I want everything. I want to be a product of what Mary Kay can provide me and my family. And so you can advance at your own pace. You don't have to wait for someone to die or retire um, to grow in your Mary Kay business. If you're looking for adventure or travel, every single year the company offers me an opportunity to have an all expenses paid trip for me and my husband, if you look behind me, you'll see this like little tracker. See that little toucan and I have a lay. And if you walk around my house, actually right behind me, I have pineapple and I have coral. The company is going to send my husband and I to Hawaii on an all expenses paid trip this year, give us spa treatments we could never dream of, helicopter rides, like, I mean, coral reefs, like, I don't even know what to expect. I just know that it's over the top because I decided to start and not stop in my Mary Kay business. So if you're looking for that, Mary Kay has that available to you. If you're looking for security, you guys, holy cow, in this day and age, no one should be doing life without a plan B because you don't know what the future holds for you. You don't know what it holds for your husband. You don't know what it holds for your children. And the security plan that you can bet on is yourself. You can bet on yourself. You can show up for yourself and your career, your job, all of that. It's not always as secure as you think. So building a plan B in the nooks and crannies of your life might serve you one day when life changes for you. You know, if you're looking for belonging or bigger belief or to grow personally. Mary Kay is the bucket that can fill it for you. And so you guys, I meet two types of women in, in my job. I meet women who were like me the first time, who come in and they say, Kelly, I've got all these limitations. I don't have the time, I don't have a supportive spouse, I don't have $100, I um, don't have the confidence, I don't know where I'd fit it in, I don't have time management, I don't have business skills, whatever it is. They tell me all these limitations. And I heard a quote one time that says, when you fight for your limitations, you get to keep them. And I'm just gonna like let that sit there for a second. When you fight for your limitations, you get to keep them. When you say money's holding me back, I'll see you in a year from now and money will still be holding you back. And when you say I don't have the time, I'll see you in a year from now. Time will still be holding you back from all the other things that you want on your plate. And then I meet the second group of women who were like me the second time, who said, Kelly, I've got all these limitations. I failed once before. I don't know who my customer base would be. I don't have any experience in skincare and makeup. I'm freaking afraid. All these things, I have all these limitations, but I have 20 seconds of courage because what I want for my future is bigger than what I'm sitting in right now. And they have 20 seconds of courage and I turn on, turn, they all turn around a year from now and all they can say to me is, look how far I've come. They decided to be the second version of me who showed up and said I want more for myself 
and decided to make it happen. You guys, I, I would say women who come in Mary Kay are like a leaf, like a leaf that landed in a stream. Just because you landed in the stream of Mary Kay, you are going to find yourself moved forward. You are going to find yourself progressed. You're going to find yourself promoted, a bigger version of yourself. Like, it, It's absolutely incredible, but you get to choose. Are you the first person who fights for her limitations? Or are you the second person who says, I want more for myself and I'm going to take 20 seconds of courage and see what this has to offer you? By the way, I didn't even mention, it's $100 to start with Mary Kay, but in the month of September, lucky you. The company is offering a gift with purchase for just making a starter kit decision, a $100 decision. You get to get a facial peel, one of our best-selling spa in-home DIY treatments that you could ever use for your skin, a $65 gift with purchase. So now on top of that, you're almost getting $500 of full-size products for just saying, I'm making a $100 decision. And so we want feedback from you guys. We want to know. So after um, I finish this video and all of a few seconds, um, I'm gonna post a little image that just says, you know, winners post. And I want you to comment here, and I want you to comment and tag your beauty consultant. I want you to put an A, B, or C, okay? Just so your beauty consultant, number one, knows how to follow up with you, because you might be like I was and be like, I didn't know all this was available to me, and this is something I might consider for myself. So A means absolutely, 100%, $100, what do I have to lose? I, I want this, I want more for myself, I'm ready. B means buy me a cup of coffee, even if it's virtual. Like, hey, this is intriguing, I'm curious, but I need to know, voice to voice, can this work for me? So that's B, I need a little more information. And C means customer. I am so happy, thrilled to shop with my beauty consultant, pay full price, and, and do this, okay, and be a customer. And we can't do our business without customers either. So I want you to respond on that post. That's how you get entered in our free product drawing, which will be happening at noon, noonish tomorrow. Um, so make sure to check back here. We will post the winner. But you guys, thank you for letting me take 30 minutes of your night. I'm gonna be totally transparent. Aside from my relationship with Christ and my decision to marry my husband, joining Mary Kay has been the best decision I've ever made in my life. And it's mostly because, not mostly, definitely because of who I've become. And I wouldn't trade it for anything. Um, I'm raising two children, <laughs> these sweet little precious babies, this little girl who works at my office on my desk and colors on all my notebooks in the middle of the day. I heard a quote one time that says, you can't give away what you do not possess. I couldn't give her confidence. I couldn't give her fortitude. I can't give her selfless leadership. I can't give her, um, you know, get back up skills. If she didn't see it modeled in me first, as much as I would want it for her, I couldn't teach her those things if she doesn't see it first in me. And so if you are finding yourself wanting to show up in your world as a better version of yourself, it starts by making a decision you wanna do something bigger and better for yourself. I love you guys. I am praying that I see a bunch of A's, women who just want something more for themselves. And thank you again for your time. We so appreciate it. And I hope that you'll make a decision to say yes to Mary Kay and join us in our little um, pink world because I promise the view gets better the deeper you get in. Love you guys. Have a great night. Bye.